Kittens can be born with worms transmitted from their mother. Most of the time, we won't see these worms in the stool. This is why deworming is so important at a young age. Most deworming programs start as early as two to three weeks of age. Deworming kills the adult stage of the worm. As eggs hatch, additional deworming is necessary. For this reason, your veterinarian will likely recommend multiple doses. The most common types of worms in kittens include roundworms, hookworms, and tapeworms. However, there are other common parasites such as coccidia, giardia, and toxoplasma that can infect your kitten. Some worms and parasites are zoonotic. That means they can also infect people. There are many clinical signs in kittens. Some may include a poor hair coat, a pot-bellied appearance, soft stool or diarrhea, vomiting, lethargy, or even weight loss. However, many kittens will show no signs at all. It is important to understand that different worms and parasites require different medications. This is why you should bring a stool sample to your veterinarian for the proper diagnosis. The sample should be as fresh as possible. You may keep it refrigerated until you can take it to your veterinarian. If your kitten does test positive for a worm or parasite, your veterinarian will prescribe the proper medication to clear the infection. After the course of treatment, your veterinarian will ask you to bring an additional fecal sample to make sure your kitten is clear from the parasite. I recommend that you ask your veterinarian about a deworming protocol specifically for your kitten. I hope this video has been helpful and thanks for watching.